Today, I'd like to just encourage you to keep moving forward with your walk with Christ. To daily, spend some time in the Word so you get to know God even better. People call it praying, but I call it just communicating with God. He's there, here, all the time, so why not have him part of the conversation? Making it something that's normal. It's a constant thing that's happening all day long. So when situations arise, good or bad, he's included in all of them. This way, you become so comfortable with him being there that when situations that seem really big to others, they're not so big to you because you know you're walking through it with God, that he's there with you, that things aren't out of control. They're in his hands, in his control, if you let him go ahead and step in and be part of it. Remember, God still brings dead things to life. The things may seem hopeless. They're not. In Psalms 27, 10, it says, even if my mother and father abandon me, the Lord will hold me close. I love my children so much. And that unconditional love is there for them. It doesn't matter what they do. I have a love for them that just won't go away. It's inside of me. It's deep. It's embedded in me. And God has that way a thousand times more. I don't understand it, but he certainly does. Even when we feel abandoned, he's going to hold us close. Let him hold you close today if you have felt abandoned. If you feel hurt, because he lives, it changes everything.